Patcher 16 stands as a testament to Serbia's commitment to enhancing its air defense capabilities through innovative solutions. Developed by the Military Technical Institute, this hybrid mobile short-range air defense system combines the firepower of a single-barrier Bofors 40mm anti-aircraft gun with surface-to-air missiles, offering a versatile and potent defense against a range of aerial threats. One of the key strengths of the Passer 16 lies in its adaptability to various combat scenarios. By integrating both anti-aircraft guns and surface-to-air missiles, the system provides a comprehensive defense mechanism suitable for protecting infantry, mechanized armor units, and artillery missiles. This flexibility allows for effective defense against low-flying aircraft, cruise missiles, unmanned aerial vehicles, and other aerial threats commonly encountered on the mountain battlefield. The system is located on the armor chassis FAP-2026 BSAV with 6x6 drive. The armor turret is located on the rear of the armor vehicle. At the heart of this system is the RPS-42 radar, commonly known as a multi-mission hemispheric radar, which provides unparalleled situational awareness and target acquisition capabilities. The Pulsars has been spotted with the laser range fighter and day-night sighting system. The Passer 16 main armament is the Bofor 40mm anti-aircraft autocannon. Designed in the 1930s by the Swedish arms manufacturer Bofors, during the 1970s, Serbian arms manufacturer Zastava Arms acquired a license from Bofors to produce the L-70 version. Ammunition for the autocannon is produced by Serbian company Sloboda. In 2020, a new programmable airburst ammunition containing 1,100 tungsten pellets was reportedly developed for use by the Pulsar 16. System for automatic stabilization and leveling, consisting of hydraulic arms and software that operates them contributes to time necessary for emplacement of fire position, being extremely short, less than a minute, while the firing rate on targets is 5 rounds per second. Gun fitting is done by means of a 44 rounds structure. The Pulsar 16 also demonstrates versatility by incorporating two sets of surface to missiles. On one side of the turret, it features a pair of Mr. 3ER manned portable air defense systems, while on the other side, it carries a pair of Strela 2MA manned pads. This strategic arrangement balances the cost effectiveness of Strela 2 systems with the superior capabilities of the Mr. 3, catering to diverse operational needs. In 2021, the Serbian armed forces acquired 18 sets of 50 French Mr. 3 missiles, which are currently being integrated into the Passer 16. These modifications enhance the missile's proportion warhead and homing system, making it a potent air defense asset. The inclusion of the Bofors 40mm anti-aircraft gun adds significant firepower to the system, offering a reliable solution for engaging airborne targets with precision and effectiveness. Paired with surface-to-air missiles, the Passar 16 ensures a layered defense approach, enhancing the system's overall efficiency against a wide range of threats. 
Moreover, the mobility of the Pulsar 16 further enhances its tactical utility. Being a mobile system, it can rapidly deploy to different locations as per operational requirements, providing air defense coverage where needed most. This agility allows for a greater flexibility in response to dynamic battlefield conditions, ensuring that critical assets remain protected at all times. The commencement of serial production in 2019 underscores Serbia's commitment to advancing its defense industry capabilities and meeting the evolving needs of modern warfare. As a domestically developed and produced system, the Passar 16 not only enhances Serbia's national security, but also showcases the country's technological prowess and self-reliance in defense manufacturing. Overall, the Passar 16 represents a significant step forward in Serbia's air defense capabilities offering a potent combination of firepower, mobility, and adaptability to effectively counter emerging aerial threats in contemporary combat environments.